this video is to show you how to use your uh, Actron Auto Scanner Plus. This one is a CP9580 or any Actron um, scanner, how to use it. I bought this when it was, it just came out a couple of months after from um, Amazon. It was on sale, super um, buy for 150 but it still sells for um, like 225 I think. This is the scanner um, plug that you plug into your uh, business and the port. You locate your port and you plug this in here. On most car the business end port is right around this area on your left hand side. The driver side bottom of the dash or underneath right here. Mines is right here. It's under right here. That's mine right there. So you wanna plug in your um, the scanner plug to here. Like this. Okay, when you plug it in, it's gonna come on by itself. You don't gotta press on on this one. You don't have to press on or anything. And now you're gonna scroll scroll down to. I already selected a vehicle diagnostic, and you press enter. Okay, and then you select um, the vehicle. This one is a Asian vehicle, hit Asian, and it's a 2000, select the year, it's going to ask you if it's a car or a truck, but this is a minivan so it's considered like a, a light truck, hit truck, and it's a, select the the make and the model hit enter the engine um, size hit enter then it's gonna tell you please turn the key off for 10 seconds then turn the key on so I'm gonna put it turn the key put the key in the on position Okay, and then it says when you um, did, uh, did that, press enter, and it's gonna yeah. retrieve the codes if there's a check engine light on. Mm. And in this case, there's a check engine light on on this um, minivan. Okay, finish uh, scanning. So it's saying, uh, so I need to press enter to continue. Okay, so it's finished scanning. And I have to scroll down to read the codes. And one code came up P0031 heated oxygen sensor sensor heater control circuit low bank one sensor one and that's the only code is reading if i want i can just delete this code and see if it comes up back if it comes up back that means i have to fix this problem this can be a, a sensor o2 sensor needs to replace or wiring problem or it just needs to be clean Thanks for watching.